Hey everybody, how are you? My name is Jose Hernandez. I'm group famous coordinator here at the Oak Ridge Wellness Center. Welcome to Street Friday. Today we're gonna start doing hypertrophy training. Now, before we get into all the details and cool stuff, I wanna address something. Currently, we're going through a pandemic, so I would recommend please always be safe and keep all the you safe. But we're gonna do three things. First, always keep our face masks. We don't wanna spread the dog, the droplets. Wash your hands constantly between all the surfaces we're touching. And always keep us six feet apart just for safety purposes. Now, with that said, that doesn't mean that you don't need to start training less. On the contrary, be safe and train harder and longer. Now, let's get into the list. The only thing we need today is mass and dumbbells. We're going right now with Shakira, trying to get her to move on. And also remember, we don't own the rights to the music, we're just using this for educational purposes. So you can use this exercise either piece by piece to work, you can perfect the thinking, or you can do a whole circuit training. I am going to demonstrate the circuit training part, so you can go back and forth however you want to do so. That's the beauty of the video. Second, when you're working out, you can pause the video any time, and I'm going to give you cues when to stop the video or when the next routine is going to stop. Our exercises are based on six exercises on dumbbells and four exercises on the floor, total of 10 exercises. Now I'm gonna swing those. Start your dumbbells. First one, so shoulder width, you know, put the little dumbbells on the side. Just keep your chest out and sit as far down as you can without letting the knees cave in. That's a squat. Then we're gonna switch to a dumbbell. So every for us side view, right? You're sticking your chest out, you're moving your hips back and sliding the weights down. More or less knee position, and then we're coming up. So from there, we're gonna have to start doing bicep curls. Same thing, bend over, tricep kickbacks. And we're gonna go up to our shoulders, frontal raise, lateral raise. And finally, we're going to culminate with a dumbbell swing. That way we cover all the muscles in the body in a short amount of time. We have further to do, from this point on, after the video finishes, you can come back to this video and repeat as many times as you We have further to do, let's do this. And so we're going to work through that part first, and then we'll talk about the one on the floor. Get ready. Be sure that we the cards, stick your chest out, and now start with squats. Yeah, you don't need to go fast, you just need to go at a comfortable pace where you can sustain it. I usually recommend people do three sets of 10. So that's what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna do one round of everything, of one set. Good. From there, same thing, we're gonna go for the deadlift. So stick your chest out, ready, let's go. One, and up. Two, and up. Good job. Keep it going. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. From there, we're going to turn our thumbs out. Thumbs out just for demonstration purposes. You can just grab it as hard as you can. Deep curl. There you go. Two, three, four. Good job. Five, six. Try to present the dumbbells from your shoulders. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. Side view so you can see it a little bit better. Same thing as the deadlift, right? But now the elbows come up. And we're gonna stick the elbows out. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. Now from there, the next one we're gonna do is the frontal raise. So you're gonna put your elbows in front, stick your chest out, and you're gonna bring it to the front. If you want to get a little bit more center, you can sit on it and raise. Let's go. Two, three, yeah. four, five, 
Next one coming up. Six. Lateral raises. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Similar concept. Now we're gonna go lateral raise. So keep your chest out. You will be tempted to move your arm forward. Keep your arms and shoulders back. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Good job. So we have done the shoulders. We have done the back. Now we're going to do double swings. So I'm going to move that more like a diagonal angle. So I want you to get the whole gist of it. Same thing. We're always going to keep our posture locked. We're going to let our dumbbells go between our legs. And with our hips, we're going to push them. Now, you want to leave your arms relaxed. So you're not doing a frontal raise. You're literally swinging. That's why it's called dumbbell swing. Ready? In position. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. At this point, you can pause the video and go back to where the routine started, and you can either do the circuit training or part by part. By part. Now let's go to the floor. Let's place our dumbbells in a secure location. We finished the dumbbell circuit. Now we gotta do the body weight circuit. We gotta do push ups, planks, hip bridges, and the last one, B ups. And with that, we're gonna conclude our series. So don't quit yet. Let's do this. We're gonna start with the push up. First, place yourself comfortably on the mat or surface that you're doing it. Make sure that from your head all the way to your hips, there's a straight line to the best of your Push up, you got your option bent knee. I'm gonna do it straight leg. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. From there, Go into an elbow plank. We need to count to 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good job. Now we're going to go face up. And we're going to do hip bridges, right? So from here, we're going to lift our hips from the floor. Ready? Go. 1, 2, Three, four, five, six, seven, good job. Eight, nine, ten, good job. From there, we're gonna straighten our legs, arms out, we're gonna go for a V up. Ideally, when you go up, make sure that your hips are the ones that end up on the bottom, and your arms and legs will at the same time. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. So at this point, you can pause the video, go back to where the started when you were on the mat or you can start all over from the beginning of the video. I recommend to do the video two to three times to get a, a whole workout or the part people need to do three parts. With that said, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you want to see more of these videos come visit our, our web page, I think our YouTube page, the line is closed. From there, we got all sorts of videos from all our instructors. You can see all the classes that we're going on. Also, you can come here from this and you can ask. We can tell you all our full instructors and classes and events that we got going on. Without further ado, thank you so much. Come visit us soon. Up until next time.
Yeah, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry.